Cool 98.7 Bismarck Van Dan's greatest hits. It is Wish With You at 841. And joining me now is the head coach of the Bismarck indoor football team. Now we know it's the Bismarck Bucks. It's Rich Davis. Rich, thanks for joining me again. Well, thanks for having me, Wish. Uh, I'm I, uh, I, very sad that uh, we didn't get to go with with your choice, Wish. I, I know that hurts, but uh, we think we've made a, made a wonderful choice that uh, represents the community. So, But I know it's a tough phone call for you this morning. <laughs> well, I'll tell you what. I, I actually really enjoy the logo that you guys uh, have there for the Bismarck Bucks. That is, that is one mean-looking buck. And so uh, I think you guys did well, a good job with that. Thank you. Yeah, we, we're very, very happy with it. Um, that mark, um, it was created locally um, here in town by uh, Todd Plosnitzer, uh, Dave Nelson, and his, his family and crew there at um, Image Printing. Uh, and they have created an entire family of marks for us. This is just one, our primary mark, but we'll be rolling out others later. And uh I could not be happier. They they did a phenomenal job, and, and we're very, very happy with them. So talk to me a little bit about the, the process going with this team name. Obviously, you guys were looking for one, and I saw on your Facebook page and on your Twitter, you guys were taking suggestions. I mean, uh, how did you guys end up coming up with the Bismarck Bucks? Well, it, it was a process. You're right, Wishing. And, you know, the unfortunate part is you, on these types of things, you cannot make everyone happy. Um, that's, and frankly, that's evidenced by our own ownership group. You know, uh, we had factions that would, would cheer for one and, and factions that would cheer for the other. Um, and so what we did was we just kind of stayed steady. Uh, we tried to remove the emotion. We listened to everybody and, and, uh, we, we kind of took some principles that we believed in. Um, you know, we, we thought uh, at the end of the day, we wanted it to represent the area uh the best that we could and in a kind of broad sense and we think that ultimately we found the right answer for us we like personally i I like the having a creature as part of our um uh, lineup if you will because of the mascot capabilities and all those sorts of things wish and so so in the end it was just a it was a very methodical but also there was kind of a roller coaster (laughs) you know you went we went through ups and downs and frustrations but I, ultimately, I think this is the right call for us. All right. Well, uh, it, that certainly makes sense, and I certainly like the name. The thing that hurt me the most, I mean, you guys could choose whatever name you want, but I was watching the, the broadcast on KX News, and, you know, LB Pope was learning the team name for the first time, and he was like, ah, I didn't expect that. And they were go, and he go, and they went, uh, well, what were you expecting? And LB Pope goes, well, there was a lot of talk about the Bismarck Energy, and I'm like, that was my name. But Yeah, uh, well, I, you know, LB said, you know, Coach Wish is a big-time guy here in town, so I thought we were going to go with his name. And, and uh, I told him about the ransom you're holding on. So, uh, you know, <laughs> I'll tell you what, Wish, we're going we're gonna to send you that T-shirt anyway. All right. It'll have bucks on it, but but uh, we want to convert you to a huge bucks fan, and, and uh, you'll bring the energy to the bucks games. How's that? That sounds good. I like that. While I have you, just tell me about how things are, are going otherwise with recruiting, and, and I know season tickets are going well. How are things going as we uh, inch closer to the season here? Things are, are going very well, I wish, and I, I do thank you for very much for your interest, your genuine sincerity in us. Um, we, it's greatly appreciated. Um, the tickets have just gone crazy. Uh, we couldn't be prouder. The Bismarck community ought to be incredibly proud of what they've done uh, with regard to the season tickets. We are far and away the leader, uh, not only in our league, but probably in the entire indoor football industry right now, uh, nationwide in, in season tickets sold. And, I, and I'm betting you wish it's not even close. Um, we have sold that many season tickets so we're way out there in front. Uh, you know, the Bismarck community, um, I know they have strong support for the Bobcats, uh, and I know that the, the Larks baseball team, um, the, the word I hear is that they've come out and gotten strong support uh, to them as well. And so kudos to the Larks and, and uh, frankly, to the Bobcats. Uh, but really, the, the, the uh, real joy behind that belongs with the fans here in, in Bismarck because they're, they're showing up in big, strong numbers supporting us and, and all the pro sports teams in town. So it's going to be a great environment, lots of options, and, and I hope everyone will get every one of our, our season ticket holders. And again, there are a lot, but I hope they will all go uh, sample with the Larks and the, uh, the Bobcats, etc. because it, I think it makes for a better environment for everyone. We certainly have quite the sports scene here in Bismarck. It's going to be uh, an exciting time obviously the bobcats are underway and then uh the summer and of course the spring and 
summer with you guys yeah. will be great as well. So I think it's kind of a, a neat lineup. Bobcats now we follow in behind, and then the Larks uh, take the baton and run with it, uh, kind of after in the summer. So I, I do think it's going to be a, 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 a nice, nice little lineup. But uh, recruiting is going well. Uh, we you will start to see us. Uh, uh, un- unveil some players now. Uh, we've got some pleasant surprises. I want to get them. I want to get their contract signed, so to speak, before I, I push it out there. But we've got uh, some guys that are showing interest in us from uh, some some local and regional universities, and uh, we're very excited about some of those guys. I've got a, a, the coach in me is, is I'm never going to rest until I get those you know the whole thing built out. But uh, and then seeing them do it on the field. But I like where we are right now. Wish a lot. All right, well, uh, we certainly look forward to hearing about the players. We look forward to the season. Rich Davis, head coach of the Bismarck Bucks, the indoor football team coming to Bismarck in March. Rich, thanks so much for taking the time. I appreciate it. Thank you, Rich. Very much appreciate your time and look forward to talking to you again.